welcome back to my channel. Today I'm filming a very, very, very exciting video. This was such an unexpected package that arrived at my house. I did not know City Grace would be doing PR and that I would be included for their Christmas in July sale. So they sent me everything that's kind of new for the sale, which I will swatch for you. I also want to let you guys know I do have a dedicated playlist to the brand and I have a lot of swatch party videos, um, maybe some reviews, um, but I just wanted to show you guys kind of what I had from them. So the first thing I would recommend picking up if this is in stock is their Autumn Rain palette. This was their first ever eyeshadow palette and it is glorious. It's just as good as their singles but basically it just comes as singles and you put it all in the palette so you just match the shades to the names on the packaging. Beautiful palette, such a great fall palette. It just ugh. This palette is so good, you guys. Again, I just love it so much, so I would definitely recommend picking that up during the sale. Another thing you might want to check out is a newer bundle. This is their Danny bundle. This is their version of the Pickle palette. That was an April Fool's joke. Super cute, I really enjoy this. I'm gonna have to rearrange my singles after I am done filming all these videos. Okay, and then I have more singles from them. I also am missing like their spring collection. I know it's in one of my palettes somewhere, but this is their like neutrally and like yellows and purples palette that I've created from the bundles I picked up from them over, you know, the last year or so. And then this is my favorite. This has their April Fools palette. It's the No Joke bundle as well as some other bundles that they've had in previous years. So I do have swatches for all of that. So recommend those very much. And yeah, I just have so many eyeshadows from them. Oh my gosh, so proud of the brand. And then one other product that I love from them are their cream shadows. I do have some new ones that I picked up and honestly guys, I'm so embarrassed because I haven't even used some of these new shades, but the original shades I picked up from them, I do have a swatch party video of those. So if you wanna see that, go and check them out. I love these cream shadows. I do love those single shadows. They're opaque in one swipe. Just highly, highly recommend. They might have a good deal on those on one of the days of the sale as well. So keep an eye out. The sale starts on July 21st, which is Sunday, and ends on the 28th, which is Sunday. So it's Sunday through Sunday. I don't know exactly what all the deals are on each day, but if you follow the brand on Instagram, I am sure you will be well aware. They also sent me this little card kind of giving me the rundown of things. They also did say they will combine shipping, so if you want to order on multiple days just let them know that you've placed an order on the previous day or you're intending on placing an order and then they'll just package everything up so you can save on shipping so as far as items go there will be two bundles and on that day if you spend fifty dollars you will receive the bundle for free so the two bundles are these two and i want to swatch these for you guys i did create this look with the more red tone bundle but i thought i should give you swatches of both so let me go ahead and swatch i'm gonna put the names on the screen because my claws my nails are like digging into all the shadows and i'm a little bit like anxious about that so I'm not gonna be saying the names out loud but I'll put them on the screen for you guys so I did use all of these mattes to create the eye look I have on today and they performed beautifully and then here is the next row this pink shimmer is the one I have on my lids this is a beautiful pink shimmer as well and then I also used this matte brown shade in the outer corner to just kind of deepen up the eyeshadow look. And then here is the last row. These are some beautiful burgundy type shades, shimmer shades. Oh my gosh. So there is that first bundle and you will receive this free with a $50 purchase on the day that they're doing that particular sale. And now I'm gonna swatch the green bundle for you guys. Oh my God, this is so beautiful. I have so many green shadows from them. I'm gonna redo that palette. I just showed you guys with my singles from them. I was so tempted to do one color on each eye, but I decided I'm gonna film a separate video showing you guys a look with the greens. Oh, it's the most beautiful chartreuse color. 
So there's the next row. Oh, I'm so excited. And with my skin tone, like, are you kidding me? These are gorgeous. Kind of giving me like juicy olive vibes actually from Give Me Glow, not gonna lie. And the last three shades are all shimmers as well. So there's those greens and the reds. So beautiful. So these swatches are so, so gorgeous. And again, you can get these free with a $50 purchase on that certain day. So now I'm gonna swatch these guys so these are their three multi-chrome shadows that they're coming out with i don't know what day these launch but they are 15 dollars each oh god okay here we go and again i will put the shade names on the screen for you guys oh gosh this middle one is my favorite because it has oh wow they all have such a beautiful, let me just make the middle one a little bit bigger so you guys can see the flip. Oh my God. So I will put the shade names of these ones on the screen now, but yeah, these are multi-chromes. Uh, the first one's like a blue purple. There's a purple gold and then the green blue. Look at my fingers. I could do this all day. I could do this all day for you guys. Uh, smear it all over my body so those are the multi-chromes that you can get from Sydney Grace multi-chromes are definitely like very pricey so yeah the $15 is kind of steep per shadow but that's kind of how much they are wherever you look these days I feel like so I uh, apologize if that price makes you cringe, but if you pick up one thing from the sale, I think it should be these multi-chromes. Okay, so the next section I wanna swatch are these shadows. These are from their Bright Bundle, and it comes in that white makeup bag, which I'll show you, but first I wanna swatch the shades, and again, I will put the shade names on the screen for you guys, but I did wear this bundle to work on Friday. And I do have now a Sydney Grace highlight on my Instagram stories. So if you wanna see how the look turned out, there's those four and then that mystery bag also comes with a blush, which is the blush I have on today. It's like a bright pink, kind of intimidating, but as you can see, I wore it very sheared out on my cheeks. And of course you can also use that as a you know, eyeshadow shade, no problem. And then the, the bundle also comes with a beautiful highlighter and that's the highlighter I have on. This is a loose highlighter in the shade Radiant Glow. I don't know if I can swatch this for you guys, but it's just like a beautiful gold highlighter. So if you're my skin tone, you're gonna love it. And then it also comes, the brights comes with this cute makeup bag. It's a white bag with gold lettering. So the brights comes with this beautiful purple glitter and I think you definitely are gonna need a glitter glue with that one, and then a beautiful blue. So there's the blue pigment that comes with the brights. Super pretty, here it is in the lid. I don't usually use products like this, but I have a feeling that it's not gonna be too hard. I can just use like my Too Faced glitter glue and play with those. So yeah, brights multi-chromes, and then the two free bundles. And then the last thing I have to swatch for you guys are these beautiful pigments that they're coming out with. They're called Loose Pigments. And I'm gonna wipe my arms off quick and do that. And then the other thing they did send me so generously is this Sydney Grace Liquid Satin Type Lipstick. It's a little bit glossy and it's a little bit like a lipstick. So that is the shade I have on today and they're coming out with 10 of those. And those will each retail for $10. Yeah, I kind of covered everything. And then the Mystery Bag, which is the brights that's the one they sent me they're also going to do a cool tone and a warm tone it's 25 dollars during the sale and at least 75 percent of each bags are new items and only available in the mystery bag so once you are like the mystery bags are gone they're gone for good so hopefully that covers everything and yeah let me swatch the pigments for you guys okay guys so i just want to show you the pigments look at this and you get so much product and this color is called joyful day and here's the sifter kind of just popped up. So I'm actually gonna swatch it like this because ain't nobody got time. <gasps> Are you kidding me? <laughs> 
Holy crap, Ola. What? So that's Joyful Day. <laughs> Send me hear this all over my body, Sydney Grace. I can't even handle it. This is Delightful Spark. This is the one I actually topped on my lids. So I did open this one. And yeah, I didn't really need a base or anything with these. And my friend Vanessa had kind of alluded to that on her Instagram when she was watching these, which is why I know that I don't need a glitter glue with these. They kind of have a base. So it's called Delightful Spark. Oh my goodness. Ah, oh, these are so pretty. Okay, next one is this green. I saw this on their Instagram and I was like, oh goodness. So this one is called Optimism. <gasps> are you serious? Oh my God, I wanna be this green forever. Like, do you guys see it? It has like sparkles. Oh my God, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. It's too beautiful. Holy shit. Okay, I wanna blend this really quick. Oh my God. A little bit goes a long way, you guys. A little bit go, oh, look at that. It's like a gold blue. This one is so pretty. This is like so, not a me color, but I'm so glad they sent it to me so I can like be forced out of my box because your girl is kind of a neutral for sometimes. Like I like brights, but I like brights that are like vibrant. Like I don't do like jewel tones very often. So this is like a blackened blue purple. Oh, this is purple. I need some more, I need some more. This shade is called Glee. It's kind of like the opposite of Glee because it's very like dark and like Maleficent-esque, but it's like a smoky purpley gray with a ton of like blue glitter. Oh my God. Okay, that's so pretty. Okay, now here's a pigment that's like me. This is a like a Mac blue brown kind of pigment, but since it's Cindy Grace, I have a feeling it's gonna be like way better. And I have these cute stickers too on the packaging. This is a really cool formula, you guys. You don't really need a glitter glue, which is so nice. See, it's like a, oh my gosh. So it looks more like the brown when I look at it, but I know you guys are seeing the blue reflect. This is insane. Oh God. Oh, there's the, do you see the brown when I bend my elbow? <sighs> I'm just gonna go, just, I'm just gonna go and uh, faint now because these are gorgeous. I hadn't swatched them before and then I put um, the red color on my eye. I just had no idea. I just had no idea what I was dealing with that they were gonna be this freaking beautiful. So I wonder if they'll do more or do they already have loose pigments like this? I'm sorry, like I said, I'm so like one track when it comes to Cindy Grace. I just buy their eyeshadows and then I'm like, eh, I don't really deal with a lot of like pot pigment type stuff. So I'm so happy they sent me these because your girl's gonna be playing with them all summer long. Anyway, I want to show you guys how I created this look, so let's get into that. So I want to create a look just to kind of show you guys how these shadows perform. Now, I've never actually had an issue with consistency as far as Sydney Grace goes. It's always been the same great quality from their singles. Depending on the collection, it's always been consistent, so I've been very, very happy. Today, I feel like I want to play with this bundle. It's like a rosy tone, and I believe these will be available if you make a $50 purchase on the site they'll throw one of these bundles in for free I'm not sure if you get to choose the bundle but I am sure if you check on their website they'll be able to answer all those questions or if you DM them on Instagram I'm sure somebody will get back to you so I just have um, my eyebrows done and foundation on and I have some blush and highlight I want to play with as well I just have some NARS bronzer th thrown on so Let's just get into it. So I'm going into this um, neutral shade right here. I should probably move these around. My nails are like so ready to be done, um, but I just haven't had the time to get to the nail salon. And so like I've been digging my nails into like everything these last few 
days, so hopefully. Anyway, this is the shade Laughter. That's such a cute name, so it's the lightest color. And I'm just gonna start off with the lightest shade and throw that in my crease. I really wanted to do like a different look on each eye just so you guys could see how these perform, but I thought it would be more fun if I just did it and swatched it. Like I said, I've never had a problem with consistency with Sydney Grace. Like I've never bought one shadow and had it perform you know, lesser than another, so I'm just going to show you guys how this shade range does, and then I can do another video with the other greens. Plus, I'm, like, behind on, like, a hundred other bundles I picked up from them, like the Danny bundle. I don't think I ever did a look with that on YouTube, so this is why I need to, like, stop buying makeup and actually do makeup with what I have. <laughs> anyway, so I like that. You can see there's a hint of pink. And now I want to go into this shade right here. This is the shade Treasure All. Super pretty, like another terracotta pink type shade. And I'm just going to throw that in the crease as well just to deepen things up. This is the Wayne Goss number 16 um, brush, which is like a big fluffy blender. Okay, I like that. Now I'm going into this next shade again to throw in the crease. And this is Trust. And I think I'm going to keep that kind of in the outer corner or the outer half. Oh, I really like how that turned out. Okay, so now we have to play with some shimmers. And do I dare make it even darker on the outer corner? I guess I can. I'm going to grab this uh, Sonia G. This is the Crease Pro, and I'm just gonna go into this dark brown shade. And this is called Keep, Keep Smiling. And I'm just gonna dip into that. This is a really small brush, so I'm gonna be able to concentrate that right on the outer edge. And now I'm gonna go back into this bigger wing brush and just blend the crease out some more. I go back into this shade. Okay, so I really like how my crease is looking. I kind of want to play with these shimmers, but then again, I also have these pigments that they came out with, and my friend Vanessa had mentioned when she was doing swatches that they also kind of had like an adhesive in them, so you really didn't need to, I didn't really need to use an adhesive. So I'm kind of curious. Hmm, let's just put a little bit of a base down just so we have something. So I got the Smith brush, the 256. It has like this little point, which is so perfect because all I do is I dip into the shimmer and then that point fits perfectly in the inner corner. Do you guys see that? And the shadow is so pigmented. It's the shimmery pink shade. I'll tell you the name in a second here. It's like an icy pink. And this shade is called Shine Bright. And I didn't even have to wet the brush. I just went in, tapped the brush on the shadow and it's building up so so nicely and I'm just blending some of that up into the crease. Okay now I'm gonna go in with the shade Delightful Spark. It's like a red shimmer and I just want to see Ooh, that's pretty. It's like a glitter but do you guys see that? Do you see the difference between the two eyes? And usually with the glitter like this or like a pigment, you'd really want to use some kind of glue because you wouldn't want it to get everywhere. And there is like a little bit of fallout, but nothing too crazy. So I'm just going to stop right here while I'm ahead. I think this look goes really well with the shirt I have on. So I'm just going to um, clean up my under eye and I will be right back. Okay guys, so I did finish up my eyes. I just smoked out some of these darker shades on my under eye and did do some mascara. And like I said, I do already have bronzer on. So I just wanna show you the blush I got from Sydney Grace for the launch of this collection. They are also doing a bright um, mystery bag. So I don't know if this is a mystery anymore because I showed you what you're gonna get in the brights or if they're switching it up depending on the bundle, but I'm just gonna go in with my Real Techniques brush. I used this yesterday already, and it's a pretty bright 
blush, but as you can see, you can definitely diffuse it with a fluffy blush brush. And you guys know I love blush, so obviously I have to be like super over the top with the situation. <laughs> but yeah, I love this blush. I can definitely see myself wearing it. It kind of reminds me of one of the new blushes Ofra is launching. It's like a bright pink one for the summertime. And it also reminds me of that bright pink one in the Juvia's Place palette. So if you don't want to buy a whole blush palette to try out a bright pink, this one is adorable. And then I wore this highlighter the other day. This is the Radiant Glow. This one also comes in the mystery bag. And this is so beautiful. I've never found like a loose highlighter I've been crazy about. But this one by Sydney Grace is really freaking bam. Like, are you kidding me right now? Like, it looks so glowy and dewy. And just highlighter heaven. Just want to tell you guys because I've never tried any of their highlighters. I always just buy their eye products. Like I have a ton of their cream shadows I want to show you guys. But isn't this insane? Like it's like bam, 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 bam. So that is the highlighter. It's gonna, it's gonna you know, it's gonna tear down a little bit. And then this is the satin lipstick they sent me. This is in the shade Kaylee. I believe each of us got different colors. Uh, and there is gonna be 10 shades. You guys know I'm not big on like lip liner and stuff. So I've tested this color out now a couple of days in a row. I've been wearing it to work and stuff like that. You definitely need to reapply it, but I do love the finish because it's like a gloss lipstick hybrid. So it's very cute. I definitely ended up with a more monochromatic look than I had even maybe anticipated, but that's okay. So I'm going to finish up my hair and I will be right back. Okay guys, so here is the final look. My hair is still a little bit wet, but that's okay. I just wanted to keep rolling. And so yeah, this is the look I created with all of the new products that I received from Sydney Grace. So I hope you enjoyed how I created this look. I hope you enjoyed all of the beautiful swatches of these products and hopefully you guys will be able to pick up some beautiful things from this sale and I will go ahead and link as much information as I can down below. Also, I will leave some of my friends coupon codes so you guys can get a discount maybe. I'm not sure if you can combine sales and get discounts as well. So you might want to try using a discount code and if it doesn't work out, obviously still go ahead and place your order. This is going to be a great time for you guys to try out this brand if you have had your eye on it. So also don't forget to check out my playlist because I have a Sydney Grace playlist and I think there's almost 30 videos on there. So there should be tons of information for you guys. Thank you so so much for watching. Thank you again Sydney Grace for sending me all these beautiful products and I will see you guys in my next video soon and I will definitely do more looks with the stuff I got from them for the Christmas in July sale. Thank you guys. Bye!